Steve Carter. I've uh, been, uh, been in engineering for 40 years, with Epic about 20 years. Oh, with Epic we've done, we've done, done a little bit of machine design, we've done some vision system design, we've done a bunch of modular skids. We built a whole deodorant dosing system that was kind of a Hail Mary of a project because it, it had found itself in a really bad place. It wasn't my division that had the problem, it was my sister division, but I got brought in to do this. They put too big a firm on, on, a, on a big job, but it was way too much firm, way too much complexity. And they were also doing it all stick built sequentially. They were doing the site work and then building the building and then starting to run all the piping and things like that. And that did not fit in the schedule. And so that's when, uh, when we got up there and started looking at how they were doing it and what their schedule was, their timeline. That's where Epic become a very good solution. We put it together, we figured out what we had to do, how we could do it, how we could do it in timeline. You know, you could build everything offline. You could take these two chunks of timeline, which like this, and then pull them down and set them, you know, not exactly side by side, but very close. And we could also do a lot of the checkout and a lot of the um, pre-validation off-site at, at Epic's floor. So we proved everything worked, we calibrated all the meters, we ran everything, we ran it through all the thermal cycles, we made sure everything functioned while we're still finishing the building. You know, huge time saver. I mean, huge save, huge save. I mean, millions of dollars relative to what they've got themselves into and then, you know, sliced months off the schedule.